Good day, my friends. P. Wall Park here. My neglected fenced in garden area is overgrown with bushes and briars. Today I begin the task of cleaning it up. I'm out by my growed up garden area. It's a fenced in area about, oh, I don't know, 40 foot wide by 15 foot wide. And it's nothing but briars and bushes and thorns. And I'm gonna begin taking this fence down today. Now I can't do a lot of just immediately taking down because of all the vines and thorns. But we're gonna work at it. If I can get a hole in this fence big enough to get my lawnmower up inside there, we're gonna make short work of the inside of that area. It's kinda hot today, but I'm gonna get a little bit done anyway. I brought a long sleeve shirt with me, but I'm gonna start off without it. First we're gonna cut the roots out of them vines and see if we can pull them off the fence. I got a big pile of rotted up wood, an old wooden chair that laid there and rotted away. Hopefully there ain't a snake under there. We gotta clean that up before we can do anything. Let's go get a rake. I'm not putting my hands down in there. Alright, I've got a bunch of my briars that were on this side of the fence cut loose and raked out. Cleaned up a, quite a bit of trash. Funny how that accumulates. I got one more wire to cut and I'm going to see if I can pull some of the fence down. Um, I got disconnected from two posts, but I still got plenty of vines and briars growing into it. so. First, I'm just going to give it a tug by hand, and I got my pickup truck out here. We'll take a chain to it and drag it down in a minute. See what happens. Oh, I forgot my water. Though. Okay, boys and girls, that fence is, them vines are stronger than I am. Let's take a chain and yank it down.
Might ought to back my mower up a little bit in case that thing will reach out here and scratches my lawnmower up. Give me a better view anyway. Probably just break the wire. Them vines are pretty strong. Well, boys and girls, there's more than one way to take down a fence. I'm going to have to wait around in there looking for any kind of lumber or bricks or cement blocks before I take my mower in there.
put a dent in it. Got a bunch of limbs in there to pick up. bunch of vines to pull up with my rake over here before I can drive up in this end. We think you're cleaning out this garden area though. Turn my husqvarna into a bush hog. I got quite a bit done this afternoon. I see a metal Electric fence post needs to be pulled up in there for I get it with a lawnmower. Let's see if I can yank it out of the ground. They don't tell how much poison ivy I got on I me. Mean, I ain't gonna do a whole lot more before I quit for the day. Go get in the shower.
suspect that was a tomato steak at one time.
All right, let's push our luck and cut a little bit up in here where all these briars are. I know there's some big things laying up in there, but let's see what we hit.
I thought I was going to get done today. I got a bunch of braces and pipes and scaffolding and stuff up in that end that I'm going to dig out of those vines. But I sure put a dent in that little area. Get that back fence took down and the end fences on the end. We'll be able to make it look a lot better. I'm sure I got that poison ivy all over me. But we're going to go get a good shower. See if we can wash it all off. Might take me a month to get through cleaning this area. It was like last year when I cleaned up in that pool area that was growing up. Not everything on the old homestead's fun and game. Sometimes it's just downright hard work. Want to call it a day. Thanks for tuning in, my friends. Squirrel or something up there in the woods. Pitching a bit.